guys what's up welcome back to my channel my name is Des and I would love it if you guys would subscribe and you know like a couple videos leave a comment you know get my engagement up you know help assist out so my videos can you know venture out into the YouTube universe so today we are going to be reviewing this Nadine Bobby Boss well buy Bobby Boss wig and I cannot wait to tell you guys about this wig okay so first of all can we talk about how this wig is serving angles how it is giving you cheekbone how it's just just accentuating that clavicle like it is doing it it is doing it it doing it well so like i said this is the bobby boss nadine wig and i have this wig in the color one let me get the stock card i decided to stay in my bathroom today so i don't have to like carry my stuff out so here is the wig right here this is the nadine bobby boss uh this is the bobby boss nadine lace front wig and it's a 100% synthetic wig so sorry if you thought this was human it's not okay so this wig has a five inch deep side part deep side parting you can it can't be moved anywhere else it's staying right here so uh please don't confuse a lace front wig with um a lace frontal so a lace front wig you're just gonna get lace in the front and in this particular construction of this wig you're only getting a little strip of lace where the parting is but i mean that's that's just fine you know it's fine you know i love this wig for the cut i wanted something um edgy i wanted something that can be worn every day i wanted something that's not going to tangle too much that's not going to give me any hassle no wahala no problems no nothing and this wig is it for me y'all i have been wearing this wig for like four or five days on and off i do not sleep with any wig i don't care how good that wig is i'm not sleeping with it most most likely um so yeah this wig has been treating me very very well um i haven't put any heat to it but it is heat safe and as far as the con cap construction i think it's pretty comfortable like uh i have a small head but if you have a bigger head like i really don't see why this wig wouldn't fit you because i just don't really see it so when i got this hair it can cut to perfection i don't have an issue with this hair even the um even the amount of stringiness this wig gets is very minimal you guys so whenever i'm experiencing stringiness and by stringiness i mean just like this right here when the wig starts separating right here so that's one thing that synthetic wigs will tend to do is just kind of separate and do this type of thing when that happens too much that's how i know it's time to wash it but i'll just take a brush like this instead of a wig well this is what i call a wig brush instead of this type of wig brush i'll go ahead and use an actual like brush that guys use for their waves and it just helps clump that long section back together and that's really like the only thing i have been dealing with other than that this wig's not giving me any problems i love the cut i love how it stops right you know like it's at my jawline and it's just giving me that like it's just giving me life y'all i don't even know what to say i don't even have anything bad to say. does this even count as a review because i don't have nothing else to say besides i'm showing you guys this wig it is amazing it is comfortable it is like weight it does not tangle it has not shedded it's just amazing the price point is bomb i have nothing bad to say about this wig um even one of my friends bought the wig y'all let me know y'all let me know what y'all think about this wig because if any of you guys have it and y'all have any other opinion please feel free to go ahead and share it in the comment section below because i don't know what to say sis i don't even know if this is a review this is more like a show and tell <laughs> it's amazing like look at that look at that cut and this this cut actually makes me want to go and get another wig that's just like what is this like eight inches a eight inch you know blob bob cut blob uh, i feel like i look grown i look sexy i look cute i look sophisticated i look bomb i look good i look like a baddie on a budget i look mm. all i did was cut the lace off and put it on my head i did go ahead and um i didn't really pluck i'm not huge on plucking my my parts because i feel like 
once you start doing too much plucking some people end up with like the red C parting and then some people just pluck too much the hair starts shedding I'm crazy on time for that but what I will do is I started going in with the Sally Hansen tanning spray this is in the color I think it's in the color tan I think it's called tan glow but this is the darkest shade and I just take this Put it on a q-tip and um, put it on a cotton swab and put it in the parting area and call it a day if you choose to pluck your wig go right ahead girl go right ahead i just don't have time oh and then after i do that to make the hair look a little bit more natural i started leaving my edges out so um within the past couple of months i could not find my wig grip anywhere edges been feeling real just real sensitive and I noticed that they've been getting sparse just from the friction of the lace of the wigs rubbing on my hairline. So I've been leaving my edges out. Shout out to Impressions of Beauty for gifting me this um, black edge control. It is amazing. It is really helping me while I'm on my journey to grow my edges out. And it is infused with castor oil. But yeah, it is black. And I just put this on my edges. I use my hand and I just swoop it over, put my wig on. So that's how we do that. And I feel like it looks really, really nice. Like just looking at it in the mirror, um, I feel like it looks really nice. And I've been getting a lot of compliments on this wig. Getting a lot of compliments on this wig. And for those of y'all who are always like, Oh, y'all YouTubers always say if somebody asks for a reviewer, oh, nobody cares. Y'all want to see who cares? I believe the pic. I'm going to leave the receipts <laughs> on my screen, you guys. But I literally have nothing bad to say about this wig. I feel like it looks really, really good. It looks like you got your hair cut by like a real stylist. It looks like you spent some coin on it. I would suggest getting darker colors because they just look more expensive. So whether you want to go like on the brown or the um on the brown or the darker black like jet black like me i think it'll look really more expensive um yeah final thoughts love the wig nothing bad to say about it as of yet and i've been wearing it four or five days um if anything else changes i'll go ahead and update the comment i'm gonna leave in the description box but that is it i will from now from now on you guys i will be leaving affiliate links down in my description box okay you guys <laughs> The, the way I post YouTube videos, a girl got to make a little bit of coin if you are inspired to purchase this wig from any of the links I list and it is an affiliate link. I will receive a small commission, but it is not going to charge you any extra. It ain't charging your credit card, your debit card. It's not going to find you and hunt you down. The point is, you guys, if you do feel inspired to get this wig, please go ahead and use my affiliate link. If you don't, go ahead and use whatever link you want. I am not pressed for it. I just wanna let you guys know I have now started using affiliate links. Okay guys, so that's pretty much my final thoughts on the Bobby Boss Nadine wig. I'm completely in love with this wig, like period. Like I don't even know what else to say. Thank you guys for watching this video. Make sure you give it a thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next one. Please follow me on my social media accounts and yeah, have a blessed day or holiday. Yeah, the holiday's coming up. <laughs>